Hello everyone, in this video we are going to discuss about Gestalt approach. It is another approach of psychology. In the previous videos we have already discussed about the other approaches of psychology. Remember, every Saturday we will upload the lessons of psychology for you. Now we are going to discuss about the Gestalt approach. It is another school of thought which was appearing in Germany under the leadership of Max Wertheimer. At the time of emergence of Gestalt psychology in Germany, the behaviorism was gaining ground in America. So, the emergence of Gestaltism under the leadership of Max Wertheimer and it was known as Gestaltism. Along with Max Wertheimer, his younger colleagues Kurt Kafka and Wolfgang Kohler are also involved in the emergence of the new concepts. They are against the structuralists. These psychologists felt that structuralists were wrong in thinking of the mind as being made up of elements. We have already mentioned that structuralism always thinks that the mind as being made up of elements. So, Gestalt is a German term that refers to form, organization or configuration. The Gestalt psychologists believed that mental experience was dependent not on a simple combination of elements, but on the organization patterning of experience and one's perception. That is, the Gestalt psychologists believed that our mental experiences and behavior are not compounds of simple elements as the structuralists believed. Rather, our mental experiences and behavior have patterns of organization. Such organized patterns produce an experience of the world. Therefore, the experience of world cannot be analyzed into elements as the structuralists thought. So, this concept is opposed to structuralism and behaviorism because both of these approaches took for the elements. Look at this image. When you look at these dots, your mental experience is not just of the dots or elements, but of the circle sitting on a line. It is the organization of dots and relationships that determine the mental experience you have. That is what the Gestalt psychologists try to explain. In other words, we can say, according to Gestalt psychologists, the mind is best understood in terms of the ways elements are organized. Let us conclude. Today, we have discussed about Gestalt approach and the major proponents of Gestalt approach are Max Wertheimer, Kurt Kafka, and Kohler. They believe that our mental experiences and behavior are not compounds of simple elements, rather they have patterns of organization. Therefore, the experience of all cannot be analyzed into elements. I hope you can understand what I have shared here. Ask your doubt as comments. Thank you.